A sailor once stationed here in Hampton Roads is reunited with his military working dog. Everybody's excited about this story. The organization Paws of War made that reunion possible in California. Rhett Rodriguez from our sister station shows us New at Four. <laughs> What's up? What's up, buddy? Oh my God. The smiles of sailor Carlos Aranda and retired military working dog Donnie say it all. The two were partnered together when Aranda first became a military service dog handler four years ago in Norfolk, Virginia. In the Navy, uh, as a new handler, um, you don't really know much. Um, they try to stick you on a dog who knows what they're doing, uh, who knows uh, their way around. Uh, who's been around multiple handlers. He really uh, helped me uh, become the handler I am today. Thank you, guys. Um, you know, he really showed me the ropes. You know, it's crazy to see, like, uh, think about a dog doing that. Aranda and Donnie spent three years together before Aranda was restationed to Lemoore Naval Air Station last year. After Aranda left, Donnie suffered an injury to his leg while on duty, forcing the military to retire him last month medically. During Donnie's career, he performed thousands of sweeps for explosives and even performed some with the security detail for the President of the United States. When Aranda heard Donnie was being medically retired, he called the organization Paws of War to help them adopt him. They're the first ones I looked up. I called them and then just right away on the first ring, they answered and were immediately uh, happy to help me. Nikki Dawson was a part of the team that drove Donnie across the country from Norfolk. She says that is just the first of a lifelong commitment they have made to Donnie. We will provide whatever medical care Donnie needs for the, the rest of his life, which is very important. Oh, love to see that <laughs> so reunion. To Donnie. Oh, that's so great. Yeah. That was Rhett Rodriguez reporting. Now, if you would like to help Paws of War continue their mission, look for this story on wavy.com.